Welcome back this morning on the Health Watch. Do you wear a heart rate monitor? Well, experts say they can provide a wealth of data that can help improve your fitness goals. It can also help you keep your health in check as well. Our Morgan Reiner shows us how. Roy Sages is a pricing specialist. I'm a big data guy and I like the numbers. A numbers guy who wanted to find a way to motivate himself to do more cardio. <laughs> So he signed up for his first triathlon in December, and tracking the data encouraged him. There's beer at the end! I needed to know how hard I was pushing my body um, and what kind of recovery tactics I could use to like keep on pushing it. And he loved it so much, he now wears it 24-7, tracking all aspects of his health. You can see when I went to bed, how many hours of sleep I actually got. Antonella Schwarz is a professor of exercise science at Bayer University. She said trackers help athletes understand what heart rate zones they're in while they're working out. The heart rate is an indicator of your intensity, right? So if your heart is efficient, it can do harder work at lower heart rates. So it's a good indicator of your fitness level. She also practices what she preaches. She's a hybrid athlete herself. The heart rate is probably the biggest indicator of my like long, easy runs and making sure that I can get to the distance that I want to achieve. I find myself when I'm running and I let myself, my ego get in the way and I start to push paces, I start to push zones. I can't maintain that for long enough. And so my runs either get cut short or I struggle to recover from them. Both her and cardiologist Dr. Talala Dajabi agree though, the best thing you can do for your heart and fitness goals is to work out tracker or no tracker. That's a general rule in life. That's a general rule in, in health. Um, small gains every day compound over time. And listening to your body is crucial. The number one thing is you. Number two thing is the data. So if your body is telling you things is not good, do not do it. If your body feels okay and you feel comfortable pushing just a little bit, that's fine also. Dr. Ladajavi added a heart rate monitor can help you understand your heart health, even if you're not trying to set a fitness goal. So at rest, the normal value is about 60 to 100. If you are sitting down doing nothing and your heart rate is consistently over 100, that's a problem. Even if you're at rest and your heart rate is consistently irregular, that's a problem. If you do notice an irregular heartbeat, he said to make an appointment with your doctor. Morgan Reiner, CBS News, Miami.